Boeing, the American aerospace behemoth, is integrating the fifth prototype into the testing program to expand the test fleet of its most recent wide-body airliner, the 7-9. This crucial step aims to expedite the final certification stage and ready the aircraft for commercial operation. At present, at least 20 production 779 aircraft have been assembled and are in the final phases of certification ahead of delivery to customers between the release of the fourth and fifth prototypes. A buyer has already purchased the new fifth prototype. Subsequent to obtaining all necessary certificates, it will be painted in the livery of Singapore Airlines, thereby affirming the ongoing interest of global airlines in this aircraft type. The United States Federal Aviation Administration authorized the start of the fourth phase of the certification campaign last week. This phase comprises demonstration evaluations of onboard equipment. These tests are essential as they confirm the safety, reliability, and efficacy of the aircraft systems in real-world scenarios. The 779 program has experienced extended type certification procedures and protracted delays over the years, resulting in a postponement of the commencement of commercial operations for the biggest model of the Boeing 777 family. The prototype's initial flight occurred in January 2020. However, Certification timelines have been repeatedly delayed as a result of design modifications, additional technical documentation requirements, and increased oversight by the Federal Aviation Administration. The company initially intended to begin commercial operations in 2019, but the launch was postponed until 2023. Currently, the company is aiming for a 2025 start date although some customers anticipate deliveries no earlier than 2026. A number of substantial issues encountered during the testing and certification phase of the Boeing 777 led to multi-year delays. A major problem was the cracking of the thrust links, which are critical components connecting the engine to the aircraft structure and are unique to the 777. Such an issue resulted in a four-month grounding of the test fleet in 2024, while Boeing investigated and redesigned the parts with reinforced titanium and enhanced airflow management. One of the previous setbacks was an uncommanded pitch event in 2020, during which the aircraft's nose pitched unpredictably, effectively delaying certification. The program was also subjected to increased regulatory scrutiny from the Federal Aviation Administration because of safety concerns following the 737 MAX, which led to more stringent and evolving certification requirements. Pause zero. Furthermore, workforce strikes, supply chain disruptions, and design modifications exacerbated the slowdown in progress. Boeing's objective is to expedite the validation of the 779 systems and solve administrative and technical obstacles that have impeded a speedier market introduction by including the fifth aircraft in the testing program. At present, the test fleet consists of a minimum of four aircraft, each of which is designated for a specific type of testing, such as avionics, aerodynamics, control systems, structural resilience, and commercial operation functionality. The incorporation of the fifth prototype will increase the testing capacity and mitigate the likelihood of additional delays. The Boeing 7779 is the largest member of the 777 family in terms of technical specifications. It is capable of accommodating up to 426 passengers in a conventional two-class configuration, has a maximum range of approximately 7,285 nautical miles, approximately 13,500 kilometers, and is powered by two robust General Electric GE9X engines. It is 3 meters longer than its predecessor, the 777-300ER, with a length of 76.7 meters. Boeing's 777X program, which includes the 777 and 7788 variants, is a critical initiative in the wide-body aircraft industry. Several airlines, such as Singapore Airlines, Emirates, and Lufthansa, have placed orders for hundreds of aircraft, Recent obstacles and intensified regulatory scrutiny have compelled Boeing to adjust certification methodologies 
and postponed timelines. Nevertheless, the deployment of new test aircraft and the expansion of the test fleet demonstrate the company's diligent efforts to finalize the program. As a result, the rules for quickly giving final approvals and starting commercial flights for this new wide-body aircraft are set by adding a fifth prototype to the Boeing 779 test fleet and continuing with flight and ground tests. This event is considered a critical milestone in Boeing's endeavors to reclaim its position in the global aviation market following recent challenges. The fifth 779 prototype recently completed its maiden test flight on August 5, 2025, from Payne Field. The flight, which lasted 2 hours and 27 minutes, attained an altitude of 39,000 feet and a speed of Mach 0.84. Before being delivered to Singapore Airlines, this aircraft, which was registered N2007L and designated WH-286 during testing, will endure additional testing, including electromagnetic interference resilience. Certification deliveries are currently anticipated to occur in 2026, with certain consumers anticipating early 2027 arrivals. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, please take our channel membership, which is very affordable, to encourage us.